My name is Liam Router. I am a Kendama player. I am sponsored by this company right here. It's called Soul Kendamas, uh, based out of Kentucky, run by a great guy, uh, Chad Covington. He's great with his business and he knows exactly what he's doing. It's been a really, a really big blessing to be a part of this team. So I started playing back in, technically it was the fall of 2013. I played it once, uh, a friend from school brought it in. I tried it, uh, really just learned like the basics. Um, and then I kind of put it to the side. I didn't actually get my first one until I think it was Christmas. Um, and then from there on, I was just hooked. I was addicted, playing every day. I would say on average, on like on a good day, I would say roughly two hours, maybe a little, a tiny bit less than that, maybe like hour and a half to two hours. Um, I would definitely say that the hardest trick, um, it's probably a tie between two actually. There's one called the solar flare, which is when you literally just balance the ball on the tip of the spike like this. Um, there's a guy named Alex Mitchell, he's on my team, who can do those in his sleep. Um, and then another trick that I can actually somewhat do is called the tightrope. And that is basically when you pull it up, and then you kind of just pull the string, give it a little bit of tension, and then this, the spike literally just sits right there on the string and you can balance it out. It's crazy to watch. Uh, what tournaments or events do you go to? Um, well, I go to a few every year. There's one that happens in Nashville right at the beginning of every year called Battle at the Border. Um, it's one that Soul runs. Chad Covington is the, the genius behind it. Um, I've won that twice. I won it in 2017 and then I won it this year, which was awesome uh, to take back my title. But um, I've been to a few in other parts of the US. I've been to Minnesota um, for it's the one that they have there is the quote unquote North American Championship. It's called MKO, uh, stands for Minnesota Kendama Open. Um, and I've come pretty close in the past couple of years to winning. I placed top eight in 2016 and top 12 this past year. Um, I'll be going back there uh, in the fall. There's never quote unquote a master because you're always progressing, you're always getting better. Um, it's really what you define a good trick or like a, a high enough level of skill that's all determined by you. Somebody may think that something that you're doing is easy, um, even when you think it's hard and you can't let like what they think get to your head. It's all up to you. Um, so I would I would say I have not even mastered it. I'm still working on it. I don't think I ever will. I think I'm always going to be pushing to reach something greater with this. I don't think there's ever going to be a limit to what I can do. I'll be going to the Kendama World Cup in July um, in Japan, and they have a massive crowd there. So there's going to be well over a thousand, probably almost 2,000 people there total uh, just attending the event. So it's going to be crazy to see that. I would say the main thing when you're getting started is don't listen to anybody that says that it's stupid. Don't let that kind of negativity get to your head because then you won't stick with it. There were a lot of people when I first started who thought it was dumb um, and it, it got to my head every now and then but I was able to kind of let that go to the side and just enjoy it for what, what I loved it as, and I, and I wasn't going to let their input change my mind about it. And getting past that point and knowing how to deal with that, will it'll just shoot you to the moon. You'll be doing it and completely disregarding any negativity that people have to throw at you. I definitely um, go to YouTube. There's lots of tutorials out there. Um, they'll just go over the basic stuff, what you need to know, um, how to how to work your way up in a way where you're not jumping to some crazy high skill level right off the bat. You'll work your way into it and, you know, kind of gradually get better. Thanks for being here with us, Liam. No problem.